All right, we're here with Carlos Guerra. How do you feel about your offense, man, and just um, how it looked here in the home stretch? I, don't know. Uh, I feel like our offense is, you know, doing great. Always took it. We don't have the biggest line. We don't have and the best we, uh, receivers. So we don't have the best running back. But we're on top of the stars. And something Coach Palmer always said: it's a heart. Uh, heart always overcomes hard work and talent. Always. So, uh, throughout the summer, all day long, uh, all year long, we've always had each other's backs. Brotherhood, uh, we like to call it, and we've always had heart. About three years ago, there was an article <laughs> on the register about Coach De Palma's philosophy about mentoring. You know, the older guys yeah. mentoring the younger players. Has he kept that tradition going? He's always been, like, there for us. He's, like, our, he's our mentor to everybody. You know, he, he gives us so many opportunities to learn every single day, and he's... Uh, <laughs> He's a great coach, and he's blessed to have him as my coach. You guys were up seven points going into halftime. What was the mood in the locker room then, uh, coming back out for the second half? Uh, what did you guys finish, talk about? Uh, we just talked about finishing, you know, uh, finishing strong. We know uh, they're going to stop our offense, but our defense needed to step up. And when they did, they did step up, but our offense just needed to, uh, needed to keep rolling, and that's what, that's what happened. And it was getting a little tense there at the end, yeah, though. You know? What were you feeling personally as we were coming down the last minute? I was so? feeling a lot, a lot of anxiety. Uh, it's a very emotional game, and uh, we know that from the beginning. We know it wasn't going to be a blowout. It was going to be a really tight game, and it came up to the last play, and it became a big play. And you're a senior now. Where do you see Catella football going from here? We have a lot of underclassmen that, you know, us seniors have been mentoring. So I think next year they're going to have a great offense as well. They have a returning starters like Ed Williams on a uh, playing tight end. And we have Simon Zari playing nope. linebacker. You know, he's a big force on defense. He's only a junior. So I think next year they're going to be pretty hot. Wherever they end up, they're going to do great. Yeah. All right, well, thanks for a great, exciting season and playoffs. It was great watching you on the field. Thanks a lot.